Tapi gue sound strict mm, No Kita naik burger dulu You're cleared to dock Normandy Do you need ground transport? Yes I'm headed to purgatory Navigation is becoming increasingly difficult Due to the number of refugee ships in the docking area Text from the library and Reaper controlled space. I can have them waiting for you at bay D24 if that would help. Really? Well, damn, it couldn't hurt. Thank you. Yeah. Maybe those texts will help you so you remember how to fight again. It seems the galaxy can't keep us apart. The Blue Sun's blood pack and eclipse are in my pocket. I'll send them to war when you're ready for them. Is there anything on your mind? Bye. We'll talk later. I'm sure. Yes, make it required reading. Light from the shadows, path of the Justicar, all of it. I've made sure he is backing on this. Two are having fun. Yes, Joker has been smiling and laughing at a significantly higher rate since he and I agreed upon a relationship. What? I mean, he is happier. It seemed like you two might make a good match. What? I was not so certain. When I first presented his body to Jeff, he seemed aloof. But really? What did Joker say? He said I didn't have to conform to some feminine ideal in order to impress him. I then called him on his bullshit, and we then proceeded to talk normally. After your encouragement, his attitude exhibited signs of change. He said he was reluctant, but you convinced him to go for it. <laughs> I might have helped a little. I see. Thank you for your support, Shepard. This is proving to be an illuminating experience. Ah, jokers. You just introduced me as your personal assistant's man. Yeah, well, it's the only way to get you inside. But you know I am not one. Why deceive others? You don't really want to introduce yourself as an AI with Uber-based code. They would lynch you. That would be an inefficient way to render me non-functional. Hey, Garus. I'm not Garus. What? What? Jacob Taylor is a human biotic and was once a Cerberus operative working under Miranda Lawson. Born in 2157, he began his career as a Systems Alliance Marine and served as a member of the Corsairs, 
an arm's length program for us. Jellix, the second planet in the Arai system, is a marginally an unremarkable world located far from regularly traveled trade routes. Lessus is inhabited only by a small Asari colony. I think I know which project you mean, mm. and I've got a Hesperia period statue in bay D24. Commander Shepard, that's excellent news. I'll have it sent to that project right away. Thank you so much for your help. Ah, it's getting there. So, what were you able to find from the inscriptions? Ah, it's getting there, baby. Excellent. Oh, I can't return to Monday from here. That's, 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 that's pretty high. Come on, money's. <gasps> Kaden! Surprised this place can still get supplies for a menu like this. <laughs> Maybe it's better if we don't ask how or where. I'm glad we're taking the time to do this. I could use a sanity check. Things have been pretty crazy. You know, my life flashed in front of my eyes on Mars. And there weren't enough moments mm. like this with people I care about. How are you feeling these days? Feeling up to whatever the Reapers throw at me. And grateful that I convinced you to sit down for half a second and relax. Half a second? Yeah. I think it's a good time for us to have a heart to heart. What are you drinking? <laughs> if you're trying to butter me up, it might take a nice steak sandwich, too. So? Shot of whiskey and a good old Canadian lager. I think they Canadian. have Canadian. More likely to have Batarian shard wine. At my parents' place in Vancouver, <laughs> drank more than a few beers on their balcony looking over English Bay. Yeah. Beautiful view. You know what, though? I feel good about our chances. Yeah? Yeah. Lets me sleep better at night. You're not sleeping, Caden? Maybe a little restless. The war isn't the only thing keeping me up at night. I wonder about us. Us. I um I have feelings oh, okay, for sure. then, then I'm okay, then. And I want more. I want to understand what this is between us. And make it real. <laughs> that's what I want. What do you want? I'm sorry, Caden, but we should just keep it professional. Right. Sorry, Kaden. Mm. Well, not the answer I was hoping for. Times are... <laughs> complicated. Oh, I understand. Morning. That's okay. Sorry, Kaden. So, uh, when does that steak get here? Uh, incidentally, you better be buying now. What'd you call it? A sanity check? Mm. Morning. Sanity check. Sorry, I got Liara, so... Go away, Kaiden. Kaidang. 
Merpati. Almost. Her name is Tasha Pure. Weshra, I have an audio log for you. For me? Where did this come? Oh no. Oh Tasha. Thank Manis. you for bringing this back. Manis. At least I know what happened. No one is. Dangerously close. Welcome to Casa Fabrication Weaponry. Casa Fabrication Weaponry hasn't forgotten Earth. Neither should you. Welcome to Nosastra Sporting Goods. Sport sporting? Thank you for shopping at Nosastra Sporting Goods. Manis. Manis. Ah. Hey, babe. You sure you don't want to do something a little more exciting? I love this part of the Presidium. It reminds me of where I grew up. Where's that? Armali, back on Thessia. My mother and I lived beside a park. I spent hours there. Doing what? <laughs> Reading, exploring, getting in trouble digging for ruins in the grass. <laughs> You're kidding. I was very young. Yeah, that's actually pretty cute. No one else thought it was funny. Oh, the lecture my mother gave me. But she did buy me my first history book the next day. I miss her, Shepard. What was she like? No, you material. She was confident and kind. She loved to wear yellow. I thought she was the most beautiful woman in the world. You'll be okay, Liara. Maybe you're right. Thank you, Shepard. I feel better. I wish we could spend more time together like this. Hmm? Just friends. Mm -hmm. Friends doesn't cut it for me anymore, Liara. Well, that sounds serious. I am serious. Mm. Whatever happens, I'd like to spend my life with you. Then you're extremely lucky that I feel that way too. I know. <laughs> Oh, that's all. Give me money. Hello, Shepard. Nice to see you. Hey, it's so cold. It's okay. Money? Welcome to Cipertine Armory. Sentry interface. No. Nope. Hey, it's mail, Shepard. Professional grade equipment at reasonable prices. That's it for today. We appreciate your welcome to Agor Munitions. Agor. Thank you for shopping at Agor Munitions. What are you doing, Morbin? Manis. Manis. Manis? Oh. The clutch is stabilized? Really? That is wonderful news, my sister. You wish to name the first hatch after the one who helped us? Manis. Money is no. Ah. Money is no. Hey, money is. Found another one. Yeah, the guys in Zakara did too. Disarmed there safely. No casualties. Nice work. Found another one. Yeah, the guys in Zakara. Wait, the like NPC. Disarmed there safely. The second human specter assisted Commander Shepard in preventing Cerberus forces from killing. I need my money. Spectre status, recognize. One moment, please. Where the hell are you? Where the hell are you? I'm in jail. Now arriving at docking bay E24, emergency civilian housing. What's happening there? Thank you, human. Welcome to Batarian State Arms. Thank you for your patronage. 
her name? James? Commander, what brings you down here? I was about to ask you that. Well, after our little chat, <laughs> I made up my mind. I'm gonna join the N7 program. And you're celebrating by getting a tattoo? <laughs> sort of. See, there's no official channels to go through right now. So, I guess this is my way of making it official. Technically, I'm just an N7 recruit, but, you know, I figure with you as my training oh. officer, how could I fail, right? I'm flattered, but I wouldn't exactly say I'm training you. Not officially, but what the hell is in this goddamn war? I'm just saying, whether you like it or not, you're my direct superior and you're N7. So I take my lead from you, and you know, I'll take whatever advice you got. Really? Sure. The good advice. Well, they wouldn't ask you if they didn't think you could handle it. Here's hoping. But the real work starts now. Right. Uh huh. I know it seems like I don't take things seriously, but when I commit to something, I fully commit. Clearly. Hey, I won't let you down. The only person you need to prove yourself to is the one standing in the mirror every morning. Good point. You know, that's gonna sting for a few days. You gonna be ready for duty? Always. Hey, maybe we should get matching. You want me to get an N7 tattoo? N7? Sure. <laughs> or you could get my name done. Somewhere special. You're such a tease, Vega. <laughs> Who, me? You ever gonna make good on all this flirting? Uh, I was just... I didn't mean to... You know, I was just... <laughs> That's what I thought. Later, Lieutenant. Later. Ah! Careful! Get us! Get me in! No. Hello, preacher. I recognize you. You're Commander Shepard. And you must be Tactus. Heard the refugees consider you their leader. Yes, someone needs to sort out this mess. CSEC has tightened access to the Citadel, and we've got desperate people down here with no place to go. I also hear you need basic medical supplies. Dr. Chalkwist spoke of a mutually beneficial trade. I tried to be clear. In my experience, the Alliance looks out for their own. Trust is a hard thing to come by these days. I know you need our military supplies, but they're worth far more than your basic meds. Her offer wasn't satisfactory. I was in your gift. Your people need our supplies, and my people need every edge we can get. Your combat grade meds will make a difference. And our mission may just save everyone. Now's not the time for pettiness or mistrust. With our day to day worries, it's easy to forget we are all in this together. I'll have my people contact yours. You'll have your supplies as soon as possible. Thanks, Tactus. Oi, Garus, brother. Ele era? Garus, baby. Baby, banana. My personality matrix can predict what the real Commander Shepard would say with 7% accuracy. Hey, I've assumed full control of Eclipse, and we're committed to moving forward with Ari. Hey, how many of here? Damn, I don't have money. Hey there. Oh, it's you, hey. Your parents get here yet? Nope. It's okay. I mean, they'll get here. They always keep their promises. They. Next shuttle was probably just late or something. That's all. I'm sure you're right. I look forward to meeting you. <laughs> <laughs> episode 2 
Hey guys. No money for me. Knowles, this is Shepard. I found one of the code locations. Okay, I'll shut it down. Just need to authorize your Spectre status. Someone used this to cut off power to a dozen life support Ooh. machines in the hospital. Okay, that access code is officially disabled. Can you find any more? Ah, buddy. It's not mission. It's not. Get the log. I overheard what you said. Okay. I found this at a Cerberus station. A poison tailored to Turians. Let me see. Yes, I think this is it. With these schematics, we should be able to come up with an antidote. Thank you. The general might pull through because of this. <laughs> yes, General Corellius should make a full recovery. He's already awake and responsive. Jambi. Hell of a view, isn't it? <sighs> During our war, this place became a myth to my people. A dream glimpsed only in the memory shards. The citadel was both the heart of our civilization and its demise. The Reapers hid here first, didn't they? No one I knew had ever seen the citadel. To be here now, I don't know what to think. It might not seem like much, but a Prothean is standing on the Citadel alive. That's a victory in itself. <laughs> Perhaps. When things were at their darkest, we used to tell stories, imagining the wonders of this place. The seat of our empire. The power to sway worlds. The galaxy belonged to us. Nowadays, a lot of races have embassies here. It's true, then. You share power with the rest? It's not perfect, but it's kept the peace. Most of the time. <laughs> Hannah. Pardon me. This one has been listening. This one suspects you are a Prothean. Hey, Hannah. 
I remember your kind when you were still minnows in the ocean. This one is unworthy. This one has seen the face of an enkindler. They consider your kind to be their gods. A pity we did not teach them to speak better. You're really a Prothean? I am. But... If you lost the last war, what hope do we have? For many, there may be no hope. The Reapers killed trillions in my cycle. The odds of being a... Uh, I don't think that's gonna work. But you are still alive now. That alone is a miracle. And you still have the power to fight. My people knew your kind when you were young. Torian, Asari, Hana. There was potential in all of you. Now you must seize that potential and become the weapon you are meant to be. The weapon that tells the Reapers we are not machines. We are alive, and we will fight back. Thank you. That meant a lot. <laughs> yeah, no name. Commander Shepard, it must be an honor to have a Prothean fighting alongside you. Scary. He's starting to learn his way around. Javik is one of the best soldiers I've ever seen. The commander is a capable warrior as well, for a human who once lived in caves. Thank you, Commander. <laughs> I have enjoyed my time here, walking among the young. I will see you back on the Normandy. Reaper forces continue their assault on Sari. I need money, Jabi. Hello. Thank you again, Earth Clan. The new sons and glitter. Welcome back oh, sorry. to the human no, 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 no. That's it. Thanks. Please speak with me again. Thanks. Rogan forces reported heavy casualties in destroying a Reaper stronghold located in what was once Ragnar's space. Hey, what am I doing? Hey, Bailey Chang. You learn? Hey, Shepard. I have to admit, the place feels safer with you here. Everyone's walking around in a daze, or in my case, limping. And I wonder if we'll ever be the same. These are dark days for all of us. Thought you'd be in the hospital. If I'm breathing, I'm working. Probably the worst I've ever been hurt. Fitting, I guess, given the state of the galaxy. But if Cerberus thinks a few slugs is gonna keep me out of action... No time for rest. Good luck, Bailey. Yeah, you too, Shepard. Thanks, Bailey. You're not helping, though. <laughs> Good to see you're all right, Shepard. Miranda, what's going on? Couldn't meet in person. The Citadel is too dangerous right now. I heard about the attempted coup. Yeah, with Kai Lang's help, Udina nearly seized control. Kai Lang? That slippery bastard's still alive? He's alive and right in the middle of all this. That complicates things. I'll be on my guard. Look, I don't have much time, but I learned what happened to my sister. Where is she? I don't know that yet, but my father was definitely responsible. If he's done anything to her, I'll kill him. Miranda. <laughs> Shepard, listen. I'm being hunted by Cerberus assassins, a lot of them. I need to stay out of sight. What? Why? I heard a rumor, maybe more, that my father is working on something for the elusive man. Something big. Why would your father be working with the elusive man? Especially now. My father is ruthless about preserving his legacy. Legacy? He has an obsession with making his mark in history, ensuring his dynasty lasts forever. And you think the elusive man made him an offer? Exactly. Whatever's going on with your father can't be good. 
We have to figure this out. I agree, but I need to do this myself. Move. It's time I stopped running from him. You're sure? Yes. I can't think straight until I know Ari is safe. Be careful. Ari did blind I can't promise that, Shepard. Could you? Oh, no. No. <laughs> I couldn't. Bye, Miranda. Nice baby girl. I hoped you'd come. I won't remain here much longer. What are you doing on the Citadel, Samara? I suppose I came to oh. say goodbye. Oh, been, Faler is safe, and Rila is at rest. I felt the need to speak to you before heading to battle. Oh, better. I want you to know there is no one else I'd rather see leading us in our last hours. We'll make the galaxy proud. The largest fleet in history is already on our side. It is impressive. Most would have deemed such an alliance impossible. But Shepard, be sure to assess your force's strengths and weaknesses before setting out. What are the other Justicars doing for the war? Most have made it home. They will attempt to hold Thessia. With the odds we face, it's possible our order will no longer exist after this war. <laughs> There's that few of you? Our numbers were never great. We must prepare to sacrifice ourselves, if that is what's required. You know, I never asked you if your code has anything useful on fighting Reapers. Treat them as any other enemy. Show no quarter, mercy, or weakness. The only difference is the scale of our foe. The code is too strict to account for such small discrepancies. Is that how you see it too? You yourself killed a Reaper on the Citadel, and then another on Tachanka. Oh, wow. I can only follow oh, such awesome. bravery. Will Falaire be all right in the monastery? Or what's left of it? We spoke for some time. It won't be easy. <laughs> But if what? there is a way to survive, Falaire will find it. It was good to see her again. Perhaps it's unseemly for a Justicar to dwell so much on her family. I'm just happy things worked out. I was fortunate that Falaire saw things so clearly. And it would have turned out quite differently without your intervention. Thank you. Good luck out there, Samara. You as well. I don't know if you believe in such things. <laughs> but Goddess, go with you, Shepard. We'll both be tested in fire soon enough. Krogan leader, heard not. <laughs> Goodbye. Goodbye, Samara. Farewell, Shepard. Reaper forces continue their assault on Asari space, claiming the Nimbus cluster Good. and the Selian.
Was the Volus ambassador here earlier? Yes, he was, Commander. I need in. Spectre business. I'll unlock the office when you're ready. Yes. Did I that one? You're gonna go on about them all night. Just get the car up here quick. Little bastard's even heavier than he looks. Said? <laughs> I'm a tricker. Oh. <laughs> How long till we killed Kolak? Once the credits go through, was beginning to think you weren't interested in the money. I'm not. Because Korlak worked for Cerberus? What'd they do to you? None of your goddamn business. He waking up. This is Commander Shepard. Can you hear me? <sighs> yes. Yes, I can hear you. Tell me where you are. Still near the Presidium. CSEC will check Selkish arms when they realize I'm missing. They won't give a damn when they realize you sold them out to Cerberus. Wait. Cerberus is planning to attack a colony that. Stay calm. Help's coming. Now arriving at the Presidium Commons. Zaid used to work for Cerberus. Ask him why he's here. Why? Why go after your old employer, Zaid? Now you know my name all of a sudden. Good question. Do I not say this? Oh. Ah, that's all I'm doing. Wrong way. This one. Welcome to Kanala Exports. Thank you for shopping at Kanala Exports. Oh, 
Hello. Okay. Damn, wrong door. We need you alive to stop Cerberus. Cerberus is after a Turian colony. Kill me, and they get it. Drop my name. Shepard's investigating. She's a recent acquaintance. How recent? Very. Shit. All right, I'm listening. <laughs> Been a while, Zaid. Shepard. Glad I wasn't just making an ass of myself over a hunch. Undisciplined bastards. This is what I get for signing up at the last minute. Where's Korlak? He's dead. I'm here, Commander. I... You saved my life. I almost died because the Turians thought I was still with Cerberus. Should have avoided this. Did those marks hurt you? I'm fine. They wanted me alive until the fees were delivered for my capture. They didn't care about what I had to say. You kept mentioning a colony in your message. Information on a Turian planet's defense system. They'll strike soon. But if I tell you which planet they're attacking, Cerberus will know I turned traitor. Turn? You already betrayed your own people. We saved your life. Tell us what planet you put in danger. I can offer a bargain. The Volus bombing fleet. In tactical terms, it's worth far more than a <laughs> Or you could give us both. Oh, <laughs> dang. You can warn the Turians there'll be an attack, Commander. That should be general enough to ward off suspicion. Beat him, Zayid. <laughs> he tried to do the right thing before. It failed because you trusted the wrong people. Now here's your chance to make up for it. You're <laughs> <giving us laughs> <Bola's support laughs> and you're going to help us make Cerberus pay for using you. I can't. You can. Waste of everyone's time trying to appeal to a Volus's better nature, Shepard. Aphis. The colony's name is Aphis. Cerberus wants its shipyards. And the bombing fleet? Yes, it's yours, Commander. I'll speak with Citadel Security about this incident. You have my thanks. Took him long enough to spit that out. Zaid, what are you doing here? Later. C6 on their way. Won't be too pleased with the mess we left them. Catch up with me at the docks if you like. You get docks flat. Oh. I don't need any right? I have. Status recognized. One moment, please. The docks. Now arriving at docking bay E24. Emergency civilian housing. Don't sit down in the middle of the world. What the hell are you looking at? Nothing. Nothing. Wondered if you'd show up, Shepard. Figured you'd be too busy recruiting goddamn armies for this war you're in charge of. I could always use more help. I'll bet. I've seen footage of what happened on Earth. How? Tell you what. I'll see if some old contacts of mine are still around. Can't promise you anything, but if enough of them are still breathing, I can lend a hand. Do you know the current? Vosk, don't remind me. Little scumbag shot his mouth off on a patrol mission once. Got half his squad killed. Real popular after that. We couldn't boot him from the suns fast enough. Should have ended his tenure with a bullet. 
Do you know the current leader of the Suns? Ask. Don't remind me. Little scumbag shot his mouth off on a patrol mission once. Got out of Scorpio. Oh, Valiant. Let's try Valiant. Bye. Shepard, glad you came. What'd you have in mind? Something that doesn't involve fighting Reapers. I don't think they've conquered the bar yet. I already scoped it out. But then I thought, if this was my last day live, I'd actually like to remember it. So? So, I had an idea. Where are we going? Somewhere we're not supposed to. Mm -hmm. Some things never change, do they? Ever have that one thing you always wanted to do before you died, Shepard? Too busy trying to live. What's yours? The whole time I worked at CSEC, I'd stare up at the top of the Presidium and I say see. to myself, I want to go, go up there. there. But I never did. There were 137 regulations telling me I couldn't. So you got them changed? No. Now I just don't give a damn. Figured it's time to do something stupid just for the hell of it. Might be the last chance we ever get. A little busier than I imagined. How about a dive in the pool? Uh, you obviously haven't seen Turian swim. It's a lot of flailing and splashing interrupted by occasional bouts of drowning. <laughs> yeah, you're right. I just have to save your ass again. It'd make up for all the times I pulled your ass out of the fire. Novaria, Pharos, Ilos. We've had a hell of a ride, haven't we, Shepard? Times like these, you know who your real friends are. They're not the ones running around looking for an escape route. They're the ones who stand at your side through the worst of it. They never give up on you. I'm lucky I can say I know someone like that. So am I. Oh, what's that? You're not going to propose marriage now, are you? <laughs> now, before we head back, there is one thing we're going to settle. Oh. Once and for all. Oh, no. Not saying you don't know how to handle a gun, just saying some of us know how to make it dance. So, let's find out who's really the best shot. There are a few people in the galaxy who've seen me in action, Garrus. They seemed impressed. Yeah, but I've actually seen you dance, Shepard. No comment. All right, Vicarian, you're going down. And don't worry, I loaded it with practice slugs for when you miss. Aha. That was an easy one. Let you build up your confidence. Long range, I wrote the book. Nobody alive can do this, not even Commander Shepard. Give me a tough one. <laughs> I said a tough one. <laughs> Step aside. Miss on purpose? Do it. I'm Garrus Vicarian, and this is now my favorite <laughs> spot on the Citadel. It's windy up here. Think I'm going to erect a monument right here. Bronze this gun so the whole galaxy knows. That you're the king of the bottle shooters. Glad you're around, Garrus. Never know when the bottles might revolt. <laughs> <laughs> hey, nice. I recovered Prothean data drives from Garbug. I'll have them brought here. Commander Shepard. Thank you. I'm sure that'll help with uh, any operation we have going. 
Maybe I can upgrade one. Hi, Garus. Not Garus, who's that? Have you discovered a way to run FTL spaceships without an ESO core, Private Talavi? No, ma'am. Then consider this a serious assignment. Intel's expecting a Cerberus raid. Cerberus? Cerberus? There a problem? I thought we were fighting Reapers. Knowles, I found another spot with a Batarian. You could be. Holy crap. These are the remote navigation codes. Last week's crash at the docks, we thought it was an accident. Shepard, there were 117 Alliance soldiers on that ship. All human. Just like the patients at the hospital. So we've got Batarian codes and someone with a grudge against humans. Looks like... Okay. This code's offline now as well. Should just be one left, Commander. Let's go, I'm going to test the variant. supplies from Tactus. Everything good? Indeed. We've acquired some very useful equipment. As such, I've been able to enhance the effectiveness of our Medijal delivery Fire. systems. I've also collated information that Liara may find of interest. Check with Glyn. Have we found any new engineers for the Crucible Glyph? Five ex-Sonax Industries scientists who attempted to reverse engineer Prothean technology stolen from planet Garvuk. They are technically still wanted by the Council for hiding Prothean technology. As well, Sonax's part in instigating an illegal war on Garvuk. I'm sure the Council will forgive that for helping with the Crucible. Extend those scientists amnesty and an invitation. Right away. Hello, Shepard. Can we talk? Hello, Shepard. I'm liking the new you, Esteban. It's about time you loosened up a little. <sighs> not sure how drinking mezcal late into the night makes me a better crewman. How does it not? Gives you heart. You need heart to fight this kind of war. A heartburn, maybe. Seriously, could we at least get some decent tequila? Hey, you're the procurement specialist. Set us up. Green. Blue. Red. <laughs> yeah, <Gila. laughs> so black. Everything okay, Shepard?
Commander. Can I test this? Where can I test this? Evasion successful. Reapers eluded. Why the Reaper? Why Faster than light jump successful. Evasion successful. Reapers eluded. Let's go, Tali. than light jump successful. Kenapa ada Reaper? Tapi tak ada. Evasion successful. Reapers eluded. I'd hope for your support in the fight against the Reapers. What's going on? Seventeen days ago, with precision strikes on four Geth systems, the Quarians initiated the war to protect <laughs> Which was a clear violation of our agreement with the Council to avoid provoking the Geth. A 
treaty violation is nothing compared to recovering our homeworld and advanced AI technology. Your homeworld? You mean Renok? Correct, Commander. 300 years ago, we lost our world to our own AI creations, the Geth. After we attempted to kill them. <laughs> we didn't try <laughs> to kill them, the Chorus. We tried to deactivate them. It wasn't murder. No, it was murder. Commander, the Quarians never intended to create a true AI. It was an accident. Which you chose to correct by trying to kill them. Don't bother. Admitting we were wrong would undercut the justification for this suicidal invasion plan. You're throwing yourselves at the Geth? Again? And this time, we may have destroyed our people for good. We'd driven the Geth back to the home system when this signal began broadcasting to all Geth ships. The Reapers. Under Reaper control, the Geth are significantly more effective. Our fleet is pinned in the home system. If we're going to win, we're... Win? You insisted on involving the civilian ships, Admiral Geralt. We need to retreat or we'll lose the live ships. Where's the signal coming from? Here. A Geth Dreadnought. It can outgun anything we've got, and it's heavily defended. The Normandy stealth drive can get us in undetected. I could board, then disable the Reaper command signal. Yes. Cutting off the signal should throw the Geth into complete disarray. But you can't do that. <laughs> While they're confused, you get to a mass relay and retreat. Good. Our civilian ships have seen too much fighting already. Are you certain you can disable the signal? We'll get you out of there safely, Admiral. Our newest Admiral has also volunteered to offer to Ah, so da. Talizora. <laughs> Talizora Vas Normandy, reporting for duty. Glad you could make it, Tally. Admirals, already a team to hit that dreadnought. Thank you, Commander. I need to go. I just barely in it. Admiral? It's mostly a formality. I'm an expert on the Geth. That you are. <laughs> I'm glad you're here. If I'd known it was this bad, I would have come sooner. You've had your own troubles. I'm sorry about Earth. We've got the largest fleet in the galaxy. If you can help us, we'll hit the Reapers with everything we've got. Or however much is left from this stupid war. I thought you'd support the invasion. No. After talking to Legion, I thought maybe there was a chance for peace. Where is he? So why help them? Where is Legion? I'm an admiral. People look to me for guidance. Public disagreement would divide the fleet. I'll get your people out of here safely, Tally. Thanks, Shepard. And just so you know, I need to keep things strictly business in front of the admirals. If you'd like to catch up, let's talk somewhere private. Sure thing. I'm ready to hit that dreadnought whenever you are. How to save? Okay. Valian? We'll take the Trinity. Bye bye, Janet.